Well, scientists say they recently made what they call a stunning discovery about what's going on under New England. They say they found a lot of molten activity, much more than previously thought. I would assume reporter Steve Nielsen tells us about it new at six. In the last couple of days, there's been a few national articles out with the headline that there's a super volcano underneath New England. It's a pretty scary headline, super volcano. So I checked in with Brown University researchers who study exactly this, and they said there's no super volcano, but there is a bullseye of molten rock right below us. The video is mesmerizing, bubbling lava oozing down Hawaii's banks, an eruption no one would expect to cover Rhode Island shore. No, we don't anticipate a volcanic eruption in New England anytime soon. But soon doesn't mean ever. Hot rock. Karen Fisher and Colleen Dalton are researchers at Brown University. They found an unusual hot spot beneath our feet. When you look at New England relative to the rest of the eastern U.S., is there is this bullseye of hot rock in the mantle. It's been a nice surprise to find something exciting in our backyard. Their new analysis is thanks to new seismometers unveiled across New England in 2014. As seismic waves from earthquakes abroad approach New England, the waves slow down. Dalton says that's important. So there is a little bit of molten rock tens of miles below the Earth's surface. Dalton and Fisher say the molten rock is far, far away from exploding through the surface, though. But in terms of where you build your house or the insurance you might want to get, um, in, in my opinion, that's not something people need to be thinking about on the time scale of our lifetimes. And Dalton says if there were to be an eruption in New England, it's safe to say it's probably millions of years away. Plus, there'd be some telltale signs before it happened, like there'd be some tremors, some earthquakes, and the earth would probably start to heat up. I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.